Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. So today we are going to discuss about the arteries and nerves of the gluteal region. So basically, I will be beginning with the arteries of the gluteal region. Arteries of the gluteal region. So what about arteries of the gluteal region? We have the three different arteries. They are the superior gluteal artery, inferior gluteal artery as well as the internal pudendal artery. We have the superior gluteal artery. And then we have the inferior gluteal artery. We also have internal pudendal artery. Internal pudendal artery. So th these are the three different arteries that are supplying the gluteal region. So basically going to deep of these three arteries. So when it comes to the superior gluteal artery, this is the branch of the posterior division of the internal iliac artery. It is branch of the posterior division of the internal iliac artery posterior division of the internal iliac artery and as it enters the gluteal region through the greater sciatic foramen it will divide into the superficial and the deep branch superficial and the deep branch so actually the superficial branch it will supply the gluteus medius and the maximus gluteus medius muscle as well as the maximus muscle so these two muscles that are supplying by the superficial part of the posterior division of the internal iliac artery that is the superior gluteal nerve so and uh, when it comes to the deep branch of the superior gluteal nerve this helps in the spinous anastomosis as well as the trochanteric anastomosis it helps in the trochanteric anastomosis as well as the spinous anastomosis so this is about the superior gluteal artery and when it comes to the inferior gluteal artery this is branch of the anterior division of the internal iliac artery it is a posterior division and this is the anterior division of the internal iliac artery and this has three branches we have the muscular branches muscular branches we have the anastomotic branches anastomotic branches as well as we also have artery to the sciatic nerve artery to the sciatic nerve so this is about the inferior gluteal artery it is branch of the anterior division of the internal iliac artery and it gives of three sets of branches which includes the muscular branches anastomotic branches and as well as the artery to the sciatic nerve and also we have the final nerve that is the internal pudendal artery so this is about the arteries of the gluteal region now we'll move on to the nerves of the gluteal region so stick to the video till the end and uh, i am upshake by the way and if you like it make sure to subscribe okay so now having discussed about the arteries of the gluteal region we are now moving on to the nerves of the gluteal region so what are different nerves that you are going to find in the gluteal region so when it comes to nerves of the gluteal region we actually have several nerves we are going to discuss them in detail so we have the superior gluteal nerve superior gluteal nerve as well as we also have the inferior gluteal nerve inferior gluteal nerve and also we have the other nerves which include the sciatic nerve the posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh the nerve to quadratus femoris pudendal nerve as well as the nerve to obturator internus what do we have we have the sciatic nerve we also have the posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh we also have the nerve to quadratus femoris pudendal nerve nerve to quad femoris as well as we also have pudendal nerve pudendal nerve and as well as we also have the nerve to obturator internus obturator internus so these are the different nerves that we are going to find under the gluteal region which includes the superior gluteal nerve the inferior gluteal nerve sciatic nerve as well as the posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh nerve to quadratus femoris pudendal nerve as well as the nerve to obturator internus so actually basically these all the nerves arise from the sacral plexus so beginning with the superior gluteal nerve this arises from the ventral rim of the l4 l5 and s1 l4 l5 and s1 and it is going to supply gluteus medius as well as the gluteus minimus gluteus medius as well as minimus so these are the two muscles that is, it is going to supply we have the superior gluteal nerve arising from the l4 l5 and s1 spinal segment so when it comes to the inferior gluteal nerve it also arises from the ventral rim of the l5 s1 and s2 l5 s1 and s2 and it is going to supply gluteus maximus remember gluteus maximus maximum is supplied by the inferior gluteal nerve and gluteus uh, superior gluteal nerve that is supplied by the 
the gluteus medius and the minimus so uh, sciatic nerve it is also part of the sacral plexus and now moving on to the posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh it is arising from the s1 s2 s3 of the sacral plexus s1 s2 and s3 of the sacral plexus i am not discussing sciatic nerve in this detail because i am going to discuss in another separate video it arises from the s1 s2 and s3 sacral plexus and uh, this is going to supply the skin of the posterior two third of the scrotum as well as the lab uh, labium majus and also about the inferior quadrum of the gluteal region it is going to supply so now moving on to the now to the quadratus femoris it is arising from the l4 l5 as well as the s1 spinal of the sacral plexus and it is going to supply the supply to the inferior gemellus as well as the quadratus femoris and also it gives a small branch to the hip joint as well so now moving on to the pudendal nerve it arises from the s2 s3 and s4 spinal segments of the sacral plexus and it is going to enter through the pudendal canal moving on to the nerve to the obturator internus it arises from the l5 s1 and the s2 part of the sacral plexus and it is going to supply obturator internus as well as the gemellus superior so this is about the nerves of the gluteal region their individual root value of the sacral plexus and what are all the different structures that they are going to supply so if you like the video make sure to subscribe and i hope i'll see you in the next video and thank you for subscribing thank you